I'm pulling from one of my decks. This is actually one of my favorite decks. It's a different kind of deck. It's by Colette Baron Reed. It's actually, I think it's in my Amazon store. Um, it's called Postcard from Spirit. And what I love about this is it's the concept of like a handwritten note from your guides. And it feels good. I believe like texture is really important when I pull cards, I need to feel it. Excuse me, the colors are there. But it makes me think of like as if I was to receive an old school letter. And it re reads, dearest you, on earth, humans learn about life by telling stories and creating new ones based on shared experiences. Eventually, after repeating one often enough, it becomes your main story that you use to define yourself and the world in which you live in. I mean, how amazing is this? Think about what I said before. Somewhere along the line, you told yourself you were not worthy. Somewhere, somebody told you you were not worthy. And my question to you is, are you living the story that you told yourself? Are you living the story that was told to you and placed upon you? Are you living a false story? Or are you really in a place where you are the author and you are creating a beautiful story, one that is worthy of love in the present, worthy of prosperity in the present, abundance, good health, good fortune, creativity, inspired action. Which story are you living? Because I can tell you right now, I want to live the story that I want to create. I want to live my story. I don't want to live a story that generations have passed on to me or that my sixth grade teacher who told me that I would never ever be good at anything and didn't understand ADHD or dyslexia and um, you know how I carried that or that I always had a struggle to lose weight. I don't, I don't want that story anymore. It feels heavy. It has come to a point that you have made this your main story to define yourself and your world. So to get to the answers that you're seeking, you must get really vulnerable and really raw and hear your story when you tell it. Ask, why do I tell it this way? Is it really true? 